Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh, dear brothers and sisters, in the second episode about the life in Ramadan. And subhanallah, in Ramadan, a coup has been happened within ourselves. Before Ramadan, when it's lunch time, you have no control on your stomach. Immediately you will go and buy the food, have lunch, eat, etc., etc. Because the body is in control. The desire is in control. You can't resist not to eat or not to drink in the normal hours of your business or job or school or etc. Because the desire is there. What happened in Ramadan? What difference Ramadan is making? This is the secret of this relationship with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. In no time, with no introduction, when Ramadan comes, your soul now became in control. The stomach is there. The desire is there. And the food is around. And the water is around. But guess what? You don't even think about it. Why? Because in Ramadan, a coup is happening within ourselves. Now your soul is in control. And this is Ikhwani. Subhanallah, a big evidence that there is a way to have willing to be a person with power that I can do. Yes, nothing is impossible with the faith. If there is Iman, there is Imkan. If you believe, you can do it. That's why if you emphasize this statement and this policy to everything in our life, it will work. Nothing is impossible. All what you have to do is to build the thought, the belief, the Iman that, yes, if somebody can do it, I can do it. If nobody can do it, I must do it. Why not? Why not me? So don't act after Ramadan as if you are a different person. Stay in the same movement. Stay in your progress to improve your relationship with your faith, with your masjid, with your Qur'an, with your duties as an individual in the society. We have a lot to do. May Allah Azza wa Jal bless everybody. May Allah accept our siyam and our qiyam and our dua and our donation. May Allah Azza wa Jal send his victory to those who are fighting for the sake of him in Palestine. May Allah Azza wa Jal let us all be from the people of Al Jannat. Allahumma Ameen. Don't forget, Ramadan is not just to fast, Ramadan is to renew your relationship with your Lord and your religion and your community and your Quran. Assalamu alaikum.